So, greetings, and let's play, finish, whatever, we mothered, tormented fathers. So we somehow need to get to the switch to the right. Oh, there, there she is. Ah, she blows. I do have to say I kind of like the game. And this part. <laughs> you know, I'm not a big fan of bullshit, and if you tell me that I somehow am not able to overpower blind woman, then. Lady, I honestly don't know what to tell you. Don't call me a slut. I have the feeling I'm just missing a, uh, a weapon that would make things doable? Bearable? I don't know. I still don't know what's up with the moss. I have no idea why Gloria decided to wear the red nun cape or dress. I have no idea what... Okay, I kind of got the whole Jennifer story now. Uh, but... Still quite confused. Can I wait here? Now I have to move. I have no idea what she is, there she is. Please. What?! I hit her with a brick. With all sisters I could... So did I burn the plantation down that they were working on? So what exact... I have no idea. Oh, that's why she's calling me sister. I wasn't... Then again, I'm trying to make sense of the ramblings of a mad woman, so... So, let's try this again. This time without getting caught while I throw an item at her. Maybe? You did the same with the others! You burnt them all! With no repentance! Okay, I have to wait until she's farther away, I guess. Oh. What the fuck? <laughs> Sounds outside. You know, it would be great if you could save the game, like, after I did this mini chase scene, because it's getting on my nerves a little bit. <laughs> is someone doing a firework outside? What the fuck is going on there? Mossing again. <laughs> Wonderful. Just kill me with 
Was ist Chica denn hier? Can you? Can I hide here? No. What the fuck do I have to do? I have to somehow move this card while she is in this mini area there. Okay. Wait. Wonderful. Wrong, wrong turn. You know, this is like a stupid puzzle that kills you if you do it wrong, somehow. And you have to figure out what you have to do to make it, to do it correctly. I, I don't, this is not a big fan of this at the moment. <laughs> you know, this is how you ruin a good game. I mean, I was really into this game at the beginning. I liked the sneaking around. I kind of didn't like the puzzles. They were a little bit stupid. Especially this whole, you have to one up, down, up, down, up, down again. I kind of get it why they did it, but... Still silly, but that's all totally fine. But this, this is bullshit. This is ass of the highest caliber. Yes, glide into my area. You somehow saw the light. Even though you are blind at the moment. Because I accidentally hit the wrong button. <laughs> so I guess I have to hit her with something. Distract her that way. And then I can move the card. I don't know. I mean, you could just take the ladder and fight her, <laughs> so keep her at a distance. You know, this is my where my suspension of disbelief kind of goes uh, away because we know she's a normal, well, should be a normal human being. I don't haven't seen anything else yet. Mm. I don't know why the lights go out when she's near, but okay. But she's a normal human being, a woman, who is hurt, who is blind. So I don't know why I can't overpower her. You know, in... Um, what was the game? Uh, Haunting Grounds, I was fighting like some human half-monster thing. I was fighting someone who could... A, a robot. I could someone who could teleport and stuff like that. No, can you stop this? Can you interrupt this somehow? Maybe. Okay. Whoo! Please save. Please save. Please save. Please save. Please save. I don't want to do this part again. This was more luck than anything. I just didn't save. You're trapped in here. You can't escape. You can't. Are you there? I'm not deaf. I. You have zero chance to pick up. I have to do this whole thing again. This is how you can break a decent game with bullshit uh, 
save points and a bullshit ending. I'm getting angry at this. And if I weren't, if I wouldn't know, I would be at the end. I would stop playing this now. I'd never upload it. But lucky for you, I know that it's near the end, and I just have to be lucky or do the right thing in the right order that the game developers decided that would be the course, the right course of action. And somehow she can magically appear at the other side of this, even though there's absolutely no way to get there. She also knows that we are there, even though she's blind. You know that this is, like I said, suspension of disbelief. I can't just, I can't deal with bullshit like that. You know, I would really love to save. I will make you regret your shit, fucking whore. You make me regret my shit. Celeste was a wise one. I don't think you share that attribute. Do I have to hit her? Do I have to hit... Let's try to get her over there. You shouldn't do that! Ah! You did the same with the others! You burnt them all! With no repentance! Okay. My eyes! My eyes! You did it save, by the way? My eyes! My eyes! My eyes! There's no one here. Oh, God. Way. I can't go this way. Ah, this is something. Ah, with a knife. It's good. Ah, now I have to go all the way back again. Okay. Ah. <laughs> Sucks to be you, I guess. Oh, you fucking moss. What? 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 Oh. My eyes. You shouldn't do that. I have no idea where I have to go. I think that was the right direction, yeah. And the switch should be at the right side or so. Hopefully I save or so or uh, something. Read. You're just a pathetic copy of your Finally. Let's kill the uh, kill her with sunlight. Bitch! 
it! Yay, we finally killed the blind woman. We are the hero of the story, or? Huh? Heroin? I don't know. I'm pretty sure she can still kill us. Pretty sure she's paralyzed or so, but she's still deadly. Because we are like the weakest human being on earth. Okay, so who exactly are you? <laughs> can, can we have a little chat? You're still here. I can't be looking that great. Oh, this isn't how I want to die. Oh, really? I didn't want it to be like this. I should have never have come here. It's all my fault. Why you did you? Have it anyway. They didn't give a damn about the disease. They only used it to improve the binoxal. The moths were the final piece for the cure. And to show the world how much they were. They had noticed how moths were acting on Felton after he caught the disease in Egypt in 58. Oh, he deserved it. We were all test animals at the plantation. They used us. They made us believe we had been touched by the hand of God, giving us the disease as a sign. But then trouble came. The eyes burning, the bandage. What? The horrible pain in the head. All of this? Let's just forget. Binoxal was created as an anti-psychotic drug for war veterans. Suffering from post traumatic stress disorder. Shell shock. To forget the horrors. As a father who ruined his daughter's life, forcing her to live as a man. Felton is just like all of us. He was a victim. He could only count on the results of the experiments of the plantation. When they withdrew the drug from the market because of its crazy side effects. Wyman, that fucking bastard. Synthesizing parasites and mixing them with the drug only showed him he could do better. That it was possible to modify and control memories. Our memories. But we were only able to control the moths and be sick. Very sick. Those damn memories will come up again sooner or later. Now I understand. Felton always told the truth. He just wanted to protect Celeste from all of this, from himself, from his Jennifer. The sessions were for her to just forget. Forget everything forever. And he was the one to push her to leave. And eventually, she did. She ran away. But I still have unanswered questions. Yeah, what the fuck? It's not too 
This is not your end. Yet. You just wanted to kill me. What the fuck is going on here? It may be the end of everything. And maybe we're already dead. What? And neither of us knows it. <laughs> I'm not the one who is crazy here. Maybe we both are. Hey, could you finally kill me? It like, could have been one of us. It's really painful. No, I couldn't have. Yes, you could have, sister. But I could never forget that day. All the screams, the flames. How could you? You wanted to propagate it as a sign of God. This was not a gift. This was not from God was fucking stupid science and those two things have never been compatible we believed it it's true and we were wrong but you left us there to die i, I don't I, I don't know i i don't remember i, I can't remember it's all confusing and i, I anyway. don't know no, I don't want to die rotting in hatred. I've hated all my life. I don't care anymore. It doesn't matter who you were, what we were. You are what you have become. Look at yourself. I'm nothing like this. This is all just farce, discount story. Garbage. You know, now I remember when I was young and I would lie on the grass. Oh, I love doing this. I would stay for hours staring at the emptiness and seeing myself somewhere else where I could go far away. And now. All these memories hurt. Oh, it hurts so much. Why can't we just forget? Why? 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 Why do we have to remember? Because that is how we save our memories from oblivion. She is still alive. You. Find her. I know you will find her on top of the world. What? If God is real, I hope he is made of this love. I hope you will both forgive me one day. I already have. Smoke. Forgiveness. The hell? That looked weird. <laughs> Okay, so she wasn't Celeste, because we still have to find Celeste, apparently. Uh, are we done? No? What was going on with that corpse there that killed me? That was kind of weird, especially since it didn't appear the second time. And I still don't know what my part of the whole story is all about. How did you get in there? Okay.
What was in the bag? What did she find? A goodbye. A goodbye that spoke of hope. Hope? Do you mean to say that, despite everything, she was not resigned to the idea of finding her? I totally forgot about that part. No. Oh, so that's, that's us. Not at all. Okay. Okay. Double odds. Was this made by only one person? Storm Mind Games. Okay, there are multiple people. I saw so. With artists, with animator, programmers. Only four programmers. Additional programmers. What? <laughs> programmers and additional programmers. They did. They programmed other things. <laughs> a lightning artist. Okay, there were quite a lot of people working on this. Um, okay. I don't know if I dreamed about that or if I... When I read this, but I think this is supposed to be a trilogy? Kinda? You know? Possible? Uh, I mean, I did like the beginning. It dragged a little bit on in the middle, in my opinion. And the end was just ass. <laughs> uh, I do like Jennifer Celeste Felton, Madame Nantes, Rory Ashman, Madame Svenska. Oh, the old lady. The many TV report or video editing. Um, the ending was ass. Like the, the part of the play. But the. Yeah, the story was fine. I kinda like the twist that Mr. Scary Pants is actually uh, Mrs. Scary Pants. Uh, that's new, kinda, sorta. It's, well, okay, not new, but it's not as dragged out as. <laughs> Other tropes. Um, thank you for spreading the word. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It, I mean, in the end, it was fine. It was a good game. It was enjoyable, at least the beginning. Thank you for being the first ones to believe in us. <laughs> was this made by Kickstarter? Sounds like it. Or well, there are like a lot of people who believed in this. This is like the telephone book of New York City. Um, yeah. I still have to figure out what I will upload first because I played this and another game, but I guess I will I'll upload this because it's finished. <laughs> um, and gives me more time to record the other game, which is kinda an unlimited game. You will see. Oh well. A lot of names here. What the fuck? I doubt I haven't even seen so many different people in my life. <laughs> I'm living in a big city. Who, who are these people? Is this repeating? Their son. Yeah, who's son? The lady, Wolf, Aaron, Mugen. Okay. Somebody is like, oh, look, there's me. Saw me, she saw my name for two seconds there. Oh, come on, they just take the piss here. They are just. Okay, let me. While this is uh, moving, I check something. This is the. That is the wrong folder. There we go. How many parts? Ah, oh, 16 parts. That's okay. I can deal with that. So, a little bit more than two weeks. Devil Arts. Storm on here. Does it? It starts off again. Okay. Press B to skip. Oh no, that's different. Unreal Engine. It's been a while since I saw a game with the Unreal Engine. When was this game made? 
Let me check real quick. Gog. That's where I got it. Telltale Games. Yeah. Fuck Telltale Games. Uh, buh, 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 buh. Click, click, click. Hello. Can you load? Oh, the characters are fictitious. There is not a wet nun running around. God, can you please? Thanks. The art book. Okay. I got a game for quite cheap. So this game was made... Oh, this year. At the end of January. Okay. Is there something here about a trilogy? The left by Storman Games is a huge show. Heroes, even is blurred. Key features. Many ways to survive. The endless combinations of game dynamics make the experience available to every gamer. Stealth, action, strategic, hide and run. I kind of disagree with the action part. That's why I, that's why I kind of bought this game because I was like, yeah, maybe I can. You know, uh, also fight my way, fight the enemies off or something like that. Yeah, that didn't work out. Continue your save game. Yeah, let's not do this. Anyways, I'm way over time, but... Well, I'm not going to be like, oh, the middle of the cutscene. Well, guys, fuck you. Cluck. I thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And we will see each other soon. So, take care and... Hit the like button.